طبعا هذه الحلقه الثامنه من اساسن كريد بيدوسي انا شكون هما التولي عندنا قالك شنو؟ احرق جميع البضائع في المستودع التالي دي واحدة بس دي هي There's resolve in you. We have that in common. I saw innocents trapped in the flames. The ones in the warehouse. I freed them already. A good soldier acts when he's told. A great one is two steps ahead. Thank you. My name's Cassandra. I'd thank you too, if I knew who you were. Razidas of Sparta. You're a newcomer to Corinth. You're a spy too? An old Spartan tactic. I have my ways. I get the sense that's a Corinthian hobby. Anthusa has her Etera watching from every post. Ah, Anthusa. We disagree, but have a common enemy. The monger? We agree he should be killed, but we differ on how. What do you want to do with him? Right now, the monger rules Corinth. I want to replace him with minimal bloodshed. He'll only be dethroned if he's killed. It's simple. Yes. Diplomacy isn't something he understands. From what I hear, I'm not surprised. We arrested his top men, armed the citizens, tried to stir the police against him. It never came to be. The only thing left to try 
is a quick slice of the blade. That would do it. We'd lure him into Corinthia's sacred cave, and it'd be over. Anthusa has given me her word, and I've given her mine. She's hired me to kill the monger. She did? She has something I need, and the monger is in my way. Keep your spear pointed his way, and Sparta will thank you. I was Spartan, once. Once? Until I was thrown off Mount Aietos as a child, and left for dead. You're the daughter of General Nikolaos? All of Sparta knows your name. And here you are, alive. Impossible. I survived. I raised myself alone while life continued in Sparta. Never mind being a Spartan. Those of good character will forgive and should be forgiven. I'm on the hunt for my mother, Irini. And the only way is through Anthusa. Yes, Merini. There's no going back now. Like me, the least can always find their way home. The gods have just decided you must fight for it. They couldn't make it any easier. Chin up, Spartan. Easy doesn't exist. Goodbye, Brasidas. We'll meet again. I'm in the fight with you. Show courage. سقوط التاجر شنو؟ تحدث إلى أنو الشاب في مرسل Your plan seemed to work. The mongers thugs ambushed me. I heard. I also heard you had no problems dealing with them. It wasn't my first fight in Corinth. Or your last. We're going to take the monger to task at the theater. I've arranged a Corinthian drama no one will forget. Brasidas is worried about the anarchy that could follow the monger's death. He wants him dead, but wants it done quietly. That man is a long way from Sparta. This is Corinthia, so we'll do it the Corinthian way. I agree with Brasidas. I say we take him to the sacred cave. This isn't what we planned. The monger needs to be erased from existence. We'll fight him in a private place, and he'll die. A simple transaction, remember? If you insist, we'll meet you at the sacred cave. أصل على التاجر في الكاف المقدس والكاف المقدس راديو هذا الكاف أنت على الطائفة Shit streets of Corinth, killing my men, helping those fucking parasites. That's me. Ah, arrogant, just like your mother. You'll never rule these streets, you pig. Oh, you. Bet your pretty face I will. Get your filthy hands! And when I do, I'll rip your fucking head right off! 
and send it to the cult as proof. What? You knew? Oh, I fucking knew her, all right. She was big fucking trouble. But I'll pay her back. When I'm done with you, I'm gonna find your mother and bring her your fucking head. Vimos will wish she was watching this. Not if I bring her yours first. Get the fuck out of my city. It's not yours anymore. Get the fuck off my streets. Rekta zilemi konular arkadaşlar şey var abi. Bu kadar yani bu kadar. Akıda bunu götürün yani. Şunu hadi. You're going to fight me? You're fucking crazy. Din mu? I could have been there to watch Thibos break your neck. Don't make me laugh. Wait, no! The people of Corinth must see him die. Anthusa, take him out of here and bring him to the theater. Show everyone his cowardice. No. Ale. You wanted him dead. Here he is. It's a shame the people don't get to see him bleed. His cries should have rung out across the city. He's dead. I've delivered. Your turn. Huh. Yes. You're right. He's dead. Take his body to the square. Let the people get to the square. Mad, خلاص. I did. I owe you information. We we'll talk about your mother, just not here. I can't give you enough thanks for what you've done. <laughs> and for once, I can also thank Alcibiades. He sent you here, after all. There's more to him than meets the eye. He knew you could save Corin from that beast. Where? Everybody benefits, everybody wins. You've proven to be a very valuable business partner. Speaking of business, you owe me, Anthusa. Yes, Mirini. She came and left Corinthia in a flurry, but made an impression on me. Like a great storm. I remember that part of her well. A strong woman with great intensity. She wanted to find her place here in Corinth, but never found what she was looking for. You speak of her kindly. You were her friend. Perhaps on the surface. But she had a great pain in the middle of her that no one could get to. After Corinth, where did she go? That? I don't know. She must have given you some hint. I don't think even she knew where she was headed. All I know is she won a ship thanks to a lucky dice throw. 
Tichy owed her that much, at least. I remember the ship's name well. Siren Song. Siren Song? It was famous for weathering all that Poseidon threw in its path. Thank you, Anthusa. May the gods look well upon you, Cassandra. Visit me any time. I'll catch you up on Corinth's affairs. It seems I have an interesting future ahead of me. So do I. Siren Song. If I can find someone who knows the ship, I'll be one step closer to finding her. Yeah. <laughs> أول لا يجب إيقاع بعد قال لك الهدف إلى بقراطة مش حسب نمشي إلى بقراطة بقراطة وين؟ أوه. Hippocrates must show humility to ensure public order. Prostrate himself before the gods and declare that his skills are gods given. But that won't help his patience. It'll just take him away from his work. If Hippocrates thinks he can disrupt social order to make himself into a demigod of healing, well, perhaps the gods themselves will have their revenge. I'm sure there's no need for raised voices. Who are you? I'm looking for a man named Hippocrates. Yet another crazed follower of the madman himself. Tell your impious master that unless he makes a public apology and soon, this priestess of Ira will gather an army of faithful and shut him down. Out of my way. Oh, thank all the gods she's gone. I thought she was going to kill me this time. What's going on? I am Sostratos. Crisis has accused my master, Hippocrates, of impiety. Is he impious? He believes that beyond praying, people can take their health into their own hands and make themselves well. Fascinating. Can I speak with him? I'm sorry, he isn't here. I'll find him. If you're going to meet Hippocrates, could I trouble you with a small errand? Then. Depends what it is. I want you to bring him some equipment. He was in such a hurry, he left it behind. I could bring that to Hippocrates. Really? I'll be sure he gets the equipment. You have my thanks. How will I know when I've found Hippocrates? Follow the road southeast of Hera's watch to the cave of Pan. He won't have set up far from it. Look for a long line of sick people. He's a uh, balding, but I wouldn't mention that if I were you. <laughs> so many sick people. Can one man help all of them? أنا وصلنا لي بقراطو هذا بقراطو So what has caused this man's condition An excess of phlegm doctor In the immediate sense yes. Importantly he suffers from neglect Neglect Good food warm clothing so much could have helped But since other caretakers assumed his condition was a punishment from the gods they neglected him challenging tradition you must be Hippocrates yes I'm also very busy this will only take a moment I won't keep you away from your patients and your students observation experience and experimentation are crucial for treatment my followers are learning that I've come from your clinic in Argos so Stratos asked me to give you this I knew I forgot some things. Sostratos is a good physician, but a better apprentice there is none. 
Did you ask him to pay you for this delivery? No. I knew this would help you and your patients. That's good enough for me. Quite admirable. What did you say your name was? Cassandra of Sparta. Well met, Cassandra of Sparta. What do you need? I've been searching for a Spartan woman. What makes you think I would know her? I was told you may have helped her a long time ago. Maybe the priests at the sanctuary of Asclepios can help. They keep detailed records of all who pass through. Please, Hippocrates, I came very far to meet you. As did this patient, and the one before him, and the one before her. My patients need me, but my notes on diseases of the mind were taken. Retrieve them, and I will help you find what you seek. Hurry, this patient doesn't have much time left. I'll do my best with what you've told me. Good luck. We're depending on you. What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes, and I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself? I'm sorry. They were burned in the last attack. What? You heard me. The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. Now transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then you'll have to come with me. A patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. You must work for Drachmi just like everyone else. Whatever the commander is paying you, I'll pay you more. Then we leave. And let this person die. I could be convinced. On two conditions. Out with it. I'll take double. A life's worth a lot. And for the sake of the gods, don't tell Hippocrates. Hippocrates would never put Drachmi before a patient's life. But here, since you're so determined to be a mercenary, I'll meet you there. Don't be late. Ashwardy. Hey. What did I Hippocrates? صبر سريع طول فاتحين الله فتحنا الصبر سريع هنا طويا بقراطي مش ما يقدرش نرسل your patient poor Dimas what are you doing here when I told all Dimas here you were in need I could barely hold him back that's just the effect the great doctor has on us healers uh, there was a fire your notes were lost but I'm here to help I can always use another set of hands He'll live. If we're finished here, I'll take some time and write down what I remember of your notes, Hippocrates. I'll go see the priests for more information about my mother. Come with me. You've had a busy day. The importance of diet to maintaining one's health cannot be overstated. What good can one apple really do? <laughs> well, taken daily, they can keep the doctor away. 
but two more serious matters. I know why you're here. You're looking for your mother. You remember her? I was young then. I didn't know how to help. I turned her away. But her look of determination and despair was born into my mind. It has never left me, and it never will. After, I swore to Apollo that I wouldn't turn away another patient, that I'd dedicate my life to the cause. She made an impression on me. Your brave mother did. She would be happy to know that. I sent your mother to the sanctuary of Asclepios. Tell the elder priest a treatment for the sacred disease will soon be available to any patient who needs it. Then he may talk to you. Thank you for everything, Hippocrates. I'll go see him now. Yes. <laughs> قال لك هذا شنو أثر على معلومات من كائنة في حرم الاستقليليوس هذا واحد If you're here for your purification bath you'll have to come back another time I'm here for information In that case you can go straight to Hades I need to know about a Spartan woman who came through here many years ago did that eagle of yours shit in your ears? I'm under strict orders not to talk to any mercenaries. Especially not about Spartan women or injured babies. I never mentioned the baby. Think you're so smart? Many women pass through with babies. Now leave me. I have my own problems to deal with. Maybe I can help you. Snakes! Snakes. They're everywhere. Must have escaped from the Tholos. We keep them for treatments, but they invaded the bathhouse. The snakes killed someone? A patient was purifying himself when they slithered in. Turns out he's terrified of snakes. Fell over dead. Now the snakes have made him their home. What if I took care of your snake problem? Would you talk to me then? Oh, most definitely. The purification bath is crucial in the path towards healing. I'll take care of your snake problem. Then, you'll tell me what I need to know. Yeah. <laughs> في الفاعي قاعد يقعد يقعد يشوفين May Asclepio spare her from suffering Will she live? Not unless the gods heed our prayers Many sick Athenians have arrived in Argolis recently and very few have left. This poor girl has the same sickness. I'm looking for information about a Spartan woman who came through here. I was warned about an eagle bearer. A ruthless killer, she was called. Do you think it's wise to deny a ruthless killer the information she desires? <sighs> Healing the sick is my path. Help me get the attention of the gods, and I tell you what I can. What are you asking, exactly? Her illness seems to have no cure, and it's spreading. Our sacrifices have done little to draw the attention of the gods. Pigs, goats, all have fallen on deaf ears. We need the beast whose blood will ignite these flames for Asclepios to see. What did you have in mind? There is a rumor of a bull with skin as white as snow roaming the sanctuary outskirts. Head west of here, towards the coast. Bring it to me alive. And will offer a sacrifice the gods cannot ignore. Yeah. I'll find this bull for you. Yeah, she believes Thor. She believes Thor. Sell game to half winter. I'm going to finish for all of them. I'm going to finish. Oh, the is in a deal.
Greetings, young one. Come to offer us Clipios a sacrifice? No. But I'm searching for a Spartan mother who may have. The great goddess Ira guides many mothers to the sacred place. Surely I'm too feeble to remember them all. What are these stone slabs for? These are uh, records. We document all who pass through, uh, their illnesses, treatments, so that the glory of Asclepios can be celebrated. Then I don't need your memory. I just need to find the right stone. Um, yes, of course. That's very wise indeed. If only I had the time to help you. Listen, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm just looking for my mother. It's Chrysis. She's got every priest in the sanctuary under her thumb, and she'll squash anyone who feeds information to the eagle bearer. Then don't tell me anything. Just bring me to the stone that can. Follow me then. Quickly. We must be discreet. Lead the way. Wait. <laughs> اه ويلي ويلي امشي امشي عندي نمو Oh, I remember this tale, written during the time of the great Elod revolt. You would have been only a child. I don't need the history, just the details. It tells the tale of a woman with worms in her throat. Asclepios took off her head so we could remove them, then reattached it in her sleep. Definitely not the right one. I wonder what Hippocrates would think of these treatments. Hippocrates is a fine healer. Showed so much promise. Showed? He's healing the sick right now. He puts too much faith in his hands and not enough in the gods. When it comes to life and death, I prefer hands. Are all the testimonies so outrageous? Writers today, Thukydides, Every Pivis, the petulant Aristophanes, all of them try for realism. But what really inspires is greatness, magic, gods. This one tells the tale of a man with sword wounds. A pack of dogs licked him clean, and Eureka, a man's best friend indeed. This is hopeless. These stories. Give people hope, Eagle Bearer. Well, I'm losing mine. Tell me about Chrysis. A very powerful, dangerous woman. But it was not always so. She was abandoned here as a child and taken in by the priests. Taught the ways of the gods. She learned uh, very quickly. Was very strong-willed. And uh, before too long, it was the priests who listened to her. She was loved. But there's an anger in her heart that could not be soothed, so... And what about this one? Let me guess. It tells the tale of a blind woman who had her eyes licked by snakes. It reads... Of Sparta. Came here with child. Sought pity from the gods. Why is most of it scratched out? Oh, uh, I'm... I'll just tell you. I know this one by heart. The Spartan woman arrived filthy and bleeding from her travels. We cared for her, gave her food, a bath, and she left. Where she went, I do not know. The child could not be saved. Who does know where she went? We've been spotted. Meet me later. 
near the olive tree of Heracles at the entrance of the sanctuary. I may have something for you. And what do we have here? A priest and a mercenary out for a friendly stroll? May the gods be with you, Plistos. I was just on my way to the archives when this Mystheus bumped into me. Is that so? And what were you both chatting about so fervently, might I ask? I'm looking for my mother, a Spartan woman who came through here. This kind priest brought me to this stone. It could be hers. I am... Um, have to... There's something... I must be going. We treat the sick, eagle bearer. And we respect the privacy of those we've treated. Now please leave. Your presence can only cause harm. قابل الكاهن والسن في الخير. هنا الكاهن المسن عند شجرة الزيتون. زيتون هي رقد. What happened? He knew the penalty for speaking with the eagle bearer about her. Chrysis was clear. You didn't have to kill him. But we did. And now we'll kill you. I'm going to get him تم تهزيم كل المرتضى قلت لا والمهمات شنو
ساعد الكهنه لكي تحصل على معلومات عن قال لك هذا شنو؟ تكفل بامر الافاعي، قال لك عرض كائن انا مبسوط تعال افاعي هذا بعدين شو الدثور بالفاهم بلغ بليمور بال كان هو بليمور and is the bathhouse free of snakes i carved up every single one of those slimy malikes my babies what have you done to my babies your snakes infested my bathhouse a sick man is dead because of them you you did this i only did what pilenor told me to do what how dare you i never said kill them how could you pilenor you'll pay for this i curse you both to hades well well what i took care of the snakes now you're going to tell me about the spartan woman and the baby <laughs> I actually don't know anything. It was before my time. The man who does know is Mithun, but he won't tell you. He won't tell anyone anything. <laughs> I like your snakes. At least I got a name. Mithun. أصر الثور المقدس وعاده أي هذا مهمة الكاهن الأخر This little girl. Oh, not the best feeling. Look at shit. Did you find the white bull? Get the magic mummy. I couldn't bring it back alive. But I did manage to collect its heart. This won't be enough to please Asclepius. The beast died unwillingly, and with just the heart, we'll only be able to pray for one life. Please, Mythios. The white bull you killed was mine. My farm feeds half of Arulis. If I die, people will starve. I beg you! My husband was killed by the sickness. I have two small children. Who will take care of them if I die? I am wealthy and will pay you for this blessing. <coughs> it's okay. Give the sacrifice to them. You did this. You choose whose prayers get heard by the gods. I know what it's like to be small and forsaken. Pray for the girl. You'll regret this. Not an easy choice, Mistyos, but it's been made. The rest is in the hands of the gods. I did my part, priest. The Spartan woman you're after. You've met her? Her visit to the sanctuary is legendary. But sadly, it was before my time. The man you want is Midon, the elder priest. He spoke of her often. That is, before he cut out his tongue. 
Cut out his tongue? When he's not healing the sick, he's in the guest house. Spends a lot of time being tended to by the servants. Thank you. I won't forget you helped me. And these people won't forget you helped them. Yeah. <laughs> زرو فيها خليني ندير سفر سريع باش ما باش ما يموتوش كل مرة يزرو فيها شوفو ربما هما خلاص هما يقدروش يزرو مش فهم هما جايش لا تتحدث بالشر قال لك هذا السجوة بدون شيخ كائنة في دار الضيان بح وخلاص هنا تكون نهاية الحلقة الثامنة من اللعبة